Hello and welcome to our first episode of Plant Doctors in Action. I am Hannah Talton, a DPM student at the University of Florida. And today you all are hanging out with me at one of my farms in Mayo, Florida, where we're gonna learn about bucket traps and how we utilize them to monitor the presence and absence of moth pest Helicoverpa armidra, which is a moth we don't want to establish here in Florida because it can be very destructive to our different cropping systems here in Florida. So here we have our bucket trap. It is held up by a shepherd's hook and it is right next to our crop, which is corn at this particular farm. And so we start off by servicing the trap with, by gathering everything we need. So first you put on your gloves, you gather your insecticide strip, gather your lure or pheromone attractant for our specific pest, Helicoverpa armidra. The next step is to remove the bucket. As you see, we have our insecticide strip and moths that we caught from our previous week. And we're gonna take them back to the lab, sort them out and ship them off for molecular analysis. We then put the contents of the bucket into a bag labeled with the proper farm and trap number to locate where we have received the sample. The next step is to grab the cartridge that holds the lure and replace it. We have now put the bucket back onto the trap with the new insecticide strip inside. We have now removed the old lure and replaced it with the new lure to attract more of the Helicoverpa armidra moth. Now you have a completely serviced trap. I have five of these traps scattered throughout the farm to get a range of capture of the moths in different locations geographically. Thank you all so much for tuning into the first episode of Plant Doctors in Action. I hope you learned a little bit about bucket traps and how we utilize them in the DPM program to monitor pests all throughout Florida. If this content was really, really cool to you, please subscribe to our YouTube at Doctors of Plant Medicine and also follow us on Instagram at UF Plant Doctors. Stay tuned for more episodes. Bye.